And since Doppel would be maybe the most amazing pet we could possibly get, I am gonna roll it. Pet slash accessories. Doppel attempt number three. After becoming the richest player in Spawn PK and obtaining every possible unlock, I decided it's time to try something new. Introducing Bronzed Out, my Bronze Man mode account. Inspired by Framed and Goody, Bronze Man mode is a custom Iron Man mode just for PvP. Items must be unlocked self-sufficiently or through PK. Additionally, after an item is unlocked, I can buy and sell them on the trading post forever with the ultimate goal of max PK gear. All right, we got here a mystery chest that we're gonna buy, boom, six of them. Also sold the blood chanting stones, easy profit. Mystery chest in here, we got 240 bill on the TP. We'll buy more if we can later, but blood money is not coming in too frequently right now, so is what it is. And there's a pure hotspot, so we're gonna go do that because we need more pure points, baby. Not pure points, I keep saying that, hotspot points. We need 3,500, something insta soul. Please don't tell me to put this in the room for the rope, right? Oh no, okay, we're good. Nice, 39 bill. Good luck to Dafton. He says, let's go, baby. Let's go, finish it off. Oh gosh, come on, finish it off. Finish the kill. Finish the kill. Hey, there we go, nice. Do we get hotspot points? We get nothing, damn. Yeah, we got soul shard. Good luck to Keegan C. I'm gonna leave the CC for a moment. This is mine? Come on. Yeah, nice. Good stuff, it's gonna be tier four. Very beautiful. Good luck to kill you to hell. There we go. What the? What? He didn't eat. Good luck to Hail Victor. That's our food. Oh, nice. All right, we got the kill. We didn't really deserve it, but you know, I'll take the tier four and the and the points. Good luck to Little Etho. Okay, well, that's not too promising. But maybe we can get it now. Nice, good stuff. We didn't have a tier on us though. Tier two. Good luck to kill you to hell. We're fine. Oh, interesting. Okay, just went regular Gmail on that. The Swift Blade finisher is always interesting. Good fight. Damn, that 60 was super nice. Hey, Blood Bottle Casket, nice. 25 bill. Go to TNN, I guess he's not, oh no, he did skull. He's dead? He smited? Kill him? Oh, the smite, what do we get? Let's see. A regular AGS, nice. Collect a mystery prescription. Backs, yeah, nice, beautiful. We got the soul shards, a blood wild casket, hell yeah. 2.5 bill cash, easy, not easy, but good money, yes. I'd like to kill and chill. The man has an archaic worm. Let's see if he's a good spec web. Nothing beats the Gmall, baby. Beautiful. Give me that tier six. I'd like to Keegan C. Kill him. Bro, this guy lives forever. There we go. Jeez, tier four to tier six. Okay, so you're probably wondering, cursed, what, what's in your inventory? And oh my dear friend, I will tell you. So I bought a bunch of blood diamond items, a bunch of blood core items, Grazi rapiers, blood diamonds, AGS. I bought a bunch of bandos, but it's not here for some reason because the TP is weird. Oh, here it is. We bought a lot of bandos for blood shards, right? Oh, and also I think our stuff sold in here. Yeah, four of our mystery chests sold, nice. But we are gonna make more blood chanting stones and make more fucking profit, baby. First things first, we need more blood diamonds. Boom, blood daily released. Uh, that's not the right word for that, but it's fine. Next up, we gotta do some blood shard salvaging, boom. Boom, boom. That's gonna be 4740 blood shards. All right, I think I overdid that a little bit, but it's fine. Next, we go over to the blood core fuser. We're gonna fuse all, all four of these because we're bold. And from this, we are gonna make a shit ton. And when I say a shit ton, I mean a shit ton of blood chanting stones. Let's do it, boom. 12, but then we can get even more. We'll buy another Grazi Rapier and we'll just make three more and three more. I don't know how much profit that is, this is, but I do know that it's profit. I am actually gonna buy some more blood diamonds real quick, just cause I wanna do an extra one if we can. Boom, and then I'll buy one more, cause fuck it. We'll buy one more Grazi Rapier, cause they're, yeah, you know what, let me see if there's like any cheaper Torva or anything that we can buy, a plate body perhaps, a cheap plate. Oh, it's the exact same price, cool. All right, we're gonna buy one more Rapier. We're out of money, we've spent all of our GP, but we put that back in there. And we're just gonna, we're just gonna do a little one of these. We're gonna go here, miscellaneous, blood chanting stone, boom. One, two, and three. This is our entire bank spent on blood chanting stones, but it's a fuck ton of profit for 825 each. When these all sell, we're gonna make, I think, 400 bill profit just from these blood chanting stones, something crazy like that. It is big, big money, and that's very, very nice. And for funsies, we're gonna open up our daily here. 
25 AGSs and 750 blood money. That's not a bad, uh, not a bad little opening. Ooh, but I wish I'd seen this. This is a, a good opportunity here. We did invest all of our money, but I am gonna try to get one of those boxes and maybe open it for funsies. Gonna buy 3,000 blood money. I'm pretty sure I have some in the bank. Like, gonna 300 more? Yeah, great. Gonna go here, grab our blood money out. I think that's enough. Yeah, that's enough, folks. Maybe we can get a new pet unlock right here, right now. Wouldn't that be amazing? Epic pet box bought. What do we get? A Yoshi! That's not bad. I'm gonna sell that and maybe buy some more, uh, more blood money so we can go for more uh, more boxes because I'm, I'm feeling like the Epic Pet Box luck is it's gonna be there. There's a Malevolent Barrel just coming up, but I realized something that I should have, you know, done a long time ago. I unlocked the Blood Dark Bow but never made one. So let's make ourselves a Blood Dark Bow real quick. Beautiful. Very good weapon to use. I don't know why I haven't been using it yet, but this is our Malev setup so that we can kill someone if need be. We have our drop rate from our Fused and we're, 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 we're doing okay. Alright, it's gonna be the Malev down. Are we or anyone else gonna get a nice malevolent treat? Nope, a cute thing here. Um, this guy's using the, the Easter ring to make himself an egg and then he has a mini, a mini me pet out. He's a little, little egg in his egg baby. He's so cute. Oh, we already sold nine of them. Beautiful, it's been like 10 minutes. I, I was on my other account and I and I was looking at bunch of things. Stones. I was like, did it go, did it go, did it go? It fucking did already which means it's time for us to buy some uh, little, little epic pet boxes you know oh man all the blood money that was here is gone well i guess it's not time huh but that immediate sale real real solid proof of concept further than it was before you know there's a bunch of cheap blood diamonds here i'm gonna buy out all of them that are up to seven yep Great, because we're gonna we're gonna go another round of blood chanting stones, I think. I need to get more blood shards. Do need a little more money for, for blood corp, but I am gonna buy these. Yeah. This will be enough blood shards for a while here. Um, boom, 1800, great. That'll be eight blood chanting stones. Chuck this thing in there, boom. There are re-stones right here, and we'll get more in a second. Once once more stuff sells, or if we buy another rabies. Overplay body, great, let's buy that. By the way, I bought this because it was, I think like 120 bags. So, you know, you gotta buy those. Grab another three of these. I just realized I'm not making profit on these. I am losing money. 250 blood shards is costing me approximately 37 bill. The, the rapier at 1500, right, that's gonna cost us 40 bill per so that's 40 plus 37 that's 77 plus 7 here i've just been throwing away money what am i doing what is wrong with me the, the blood shards have to be one bag each or it's not profit that's the reality of the situation Fuck. That was dumb of me for not doing the math on it. I just, I got, I think I got excited with the, with the, with the, with the, with the shields. I mean, I'm, I'm making like a bill per at this point for these. It was more, it was a lot of profit before with the bandos. Oh man, I fucked up. But hey, at least they sell quick. Look at that. We got two item listings. This is going quick. Jesus Christ. Ten of those. That's beautiful. Okay, Yoshi. Great. That's a relief, honestly. Some cheap blood money in here too. Good timing. We got a shit ton of blood money. We buy epic pet boxes, and that's a better money maker. We know that. At least take longer to sell, but I know for a fact that they are profit. Boom. Yeah, they've been going for like 85 each, so I'll just stick them at 85. No, they haven't really been selling it higher. So with these at 85 each, our TP is looking like 1.56 trill. That's not bad at all. And because I like opening things, as you guys know, we're gonna change that quantity to 11. All right, and we're maybe gonna get something now? Okay, what about this one? Another Yoshi. Great, we made back the money. Yoshi coming in clutch though. Oh, something sold. What do we got, baby, what do we got? Blood chanting stones, great. Yeah, so every epic pet box is four bill profit, so not bad. Although I will say, I think these are best profit. Although blood money's just, it's just so expensive right now. So I, I don't know, it's hard to say, but I think these are the way to go. So the prize for this tournament is a neck scroll, which would save me so much time for uh, for hotspot points, plus this $45 bomb that's in here. So first target's B South, so we're probably gonna lose. Um, good fight. All right, I don't know why he risked it there, but he did. I will def 12 said, Ah, YouTube. Next round, cool, crazy. Break it, and then maybe we get a huge combo. Come on, kill him. Ah, we could have done it there. We had so many chances, but the RNG did not come through. Uh, Blood Shedding Stone sold, Yoshi Pet sold. We got two more epic pet boxes from the thing. All right, let's see what we sold here. Very nice, one of the mystery chests, which is the rest of our mystery chests, and 11 of the epic pet boxes. 1.4 Trill Cash to our name. I am gonna cancel this, and I'm gonna open one of them right now. <gasps> Oh man, green Rift Guardian unlocked though. It's our first Rift Guardian ever. So that's kind of awful, but good. And seven, second one, Mini Me, nice, okay. And since Doppel would be maybe the most amazing pet we could possibly get, I am gonna roll it for the fuck of it. Pet slash accessories, Doppel attempt number three. <gasps> Oh, bought some blood money. I'm gonna buy another mini me because fuck it. Sometimes you just gotta you gotta go for it. It was 140 bill. It was either like 160. Please give me this. It would be so amazing to get. 
Fourth attempt, gone. I was gonna say fuck it and get a claw attempt right here. That cost me 70 bill. That's a way too much money. Weapons, claws or attempt number two, <gasps> gone. Ugh. I know I shouldn't have done any of that. That was a mistake, but you know, you lose some and you lose some. Golden Hunger Games, kill him. Ah, uh, good fight. You know what? I don't regret going for the uh, for the doppel. It's just it's just such a good pet that we're gonna so need eventually. Back at it again. Use both these specs and kill him. Easy free money. No, that sucks. And the goldens are done. I have a plan here. We're gonna rub our Slayer Crystal right here. I'm gonna go home and we are going to go do some cave tasks. I really, really am so desperate, like so, so desperate to finally get the, the relic. All right, so we are gonna go over to the Slayer Cave. We are ready now. It wasn't before. This is our gear and this is what we're looking like. Let's get our task. Enraged Frost Dragons, eh. But on the upside, they are right here, so that's pretty cool. Hey, there's a little safe spot here for anybody who's interested. Now, at the end of our 45 minutes here, I am gonna go into the little cave with the boss, and I'm gonna kill the boss at least once. Oh my gosh, that was a lot of things. Best things from these are Frost with Mystery Chest. So the Mystery Chest is the best thing. I was gonna keep going through the list, but really the only good thing here is the Mystery Chest. And another mistake I just realized, I should be wearing prayer gear, so I should be wearing like a Zamorak top and bottoms, but that's fine. We will fix that for next time. Hey, look at that. We got a frost whip from an, from an enraged frost dragon. He did a, a whole yell and everything. Check our, our little little bag here. Oh my god, these things fill up your bag. If only it was worth something, huh? We did our frost dragon daily. It's 10 bill cash, 50 blood money, some dragon bones, treasure casket. Nice. I think it might be good to like bring a, a like a T-bow here. I know that sounds weird, but like some tasks I think are great with this whip bow. Like this is not a great one, uh, but like Something like Hellhounds is perfect for a swift bow, but like this would be great with a T-bow because we'd be hitting like hundreds because it has high magic attack or defense, whatever it is. In the comments, someone tell me if I'm right. Alrighty, this is going to be task completed. It's weird that we went 21 kills with no Larence keys. 60 Blood Slayer points, damn, wow, I was not expecting that. Next task, Abbey Demons. Hey, donate a mystery box from an enraged abyssal demon. Why did a point mystery box yell? Task completed, and again, no Larence keys on this one. 60 Blood Slayer points though. All right, Mr. Blood Slayer Master, Lava Dragons it is, let's go. Now these can drop Lava Whips, Donator Boxes, Mystery Chests, not Lava Keys? I would've thought Lava Keys. I just realized I didn't explain the logic behind, I think I already explained this once before. No, 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 no. I didn't explain why I'm I'm doing this whole task and then doing the boss, so at the end of your magic sickness, you can tell you right out of this cave. But currently, I'm not able to do so. Also, the more kills that you get, the higher your drop rate is. So ideally, I would've stacked up more of these, uh, these essences, but I just didn't, I wasn't able to. I didn't have them in the bank, so. I didn't. Also, I should have brought a fairy pet. That was a mistake that I just made. Oh, we got 25 blood diamonds. Oh shit, how rare is that? One in 750 on 4KC? Jesus Christ. Oh, uh, we just completed our lava dragon daily too. I didn't even know that was a daily. We also got our rune pouch, um, which is a yellable as well. What's the rate on that? Bro, what? How am I getting so lucky? I've killed 10 of these. Task completed. Another 60 slayer points. This is what our looting bag is looking like now. Next task, chaos druids. Love this one because it helps us work towards our cursed ancient staff grind. Also, hey, we're not too far off from uh, from 200 mil Slayer XP, which is kind of crazy. 30 mil left to go. I'll definitely keep an eye on that. All right, that's going to be task completed. Another 60 Blood Slayer points. Always welcome. This is how our looting bag is looking. We ended up with four keys total. We have three minutes left on our magic sickness. I'm tempted to go like kill, maybe get another another task here, but I kind of want to just knock out the uh, boss. But I do think I'm going to. This is my first time doing this boss actually ever. I haven't done it on my main either. Oh, look at these dark beasts. Ooh, look at they're, they're, they're pretty. Drops aren't very good, but look at these beasts. Into the boss room we go, right? How much blood money we get? Yeah, we'll put 4k, that's not bad. Can we go in? Let's do it. How do we use this, uh, oh, we talk to this guy. Give offerings to the necromancer. Here you go, sir, give me the beast. Ooh, what is this little blood thing? What's going on here? Do I just have to dodge the blood stuff? I guess I probably do, right? Okay, moment of truth, what do we get from our first ever Blood Slayer Beast boss kill? Give me something good. Uh, some cave essence, some blood money, some coins. Not amazing, but not not bad. I'll do another task here, see if we can get maybe like two keys of, the, of a certain kind. I mean, I 20 from them, hmm. By the way, the reason why I have the looting bag and why this all went to the inventory is because that's how this cave works. Anything that your Yoshi picks up goes to your inventory or looting bag does not go to the bank. Enraged Rune Dragons. And these bad boys drop the loop, so I can probably get one of these within the, the 30 kills, 20 kills, yeah, okay. I'll try for another kill here. We got a loop half, so we're partially there. And task completed. And this is the final task of our double Slayer points. Look at that, we, we got our Blood Slayer daily in here. We're, we're gonna have so many rewards waiting for us at colon colon home. We don't have enough to get another boss kill. I'm wondering if we can kill things off task. No, we can't. I think I'm gonna tell you out. But this was a good experience. We'll, we'll, we will alien out, 
I'll show you guys my looting bag. All in all, very successful trip. This is another three kills uh, for the boss. Got 2k blood money, five Larian's keys, a bunch of random items here, blood diamonds, frost whip, ancient wyvern shield, and we did so many dailies. We got 200 uh, bags, 100 blood money, 500 uh, dragon bones, six treasure caskets, 200 blood money, and 20 point mystery boxes. Opening nine treasure caskets, what do we get? All those from dailies, and that's probably not, ooh, we definitely were better off selling there. That's a, a rough set of loot. Thank <music> you.